All right, guys, let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. Um, I just there's something else that I got, we want to talk about. It's uh, megalopolo megalopolis. Hey, hey. Yo, yo, yo. Hey. Megalopolis. Hey, you got Me it. Megalopolis, yeah. So ah, after no, ah, those letters were shuffling you, dog. <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, say it slow, my, dog. English say data, slow. My, my English data bundles had depleted. So after <laughs> Metropolis, <laughs> after a Metropolis, I think it's a Megalopolis, right? If I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Like in terms of like the city, the the, the um, size of the city. That, that makes sense, actually. I don't yeah. know, but that makes sense. I remember that in geography. You guys can correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. But yeah, so Francis Ford Coppola, the guy who directed The Godfather, that guy who directed Dracula in the 90s, that guy, the father of Sofia Ford Coppola, yeah, he, the, he actually... Oh, he's got some dope movies. Yeah, he actually di uh, directed this movie, Me Me uh, Megalopolis, and he's been thinking about it for decades. Uh, he actually, uh, um, uh, what's this, funded this movie himself, like out uh, of his own him, pocket. Tell him how to shoot a trailer, because I was hella confused. There's nothing on this trailer, dog. Like, because <laughs> some people were can like, I, this is can click. I... This is Men in Black 3. This, it actually intrigued me, because it got me curious, because I, something was happening, uh -huh. and um, the way it was shot, it was beautifully shot. Um, the the camera angle was beautiful. Right. The um, the colors were, were were beautiful, and I'm waiting for something. I'm waiting for something, and nothing actually happens. So it, right. it, it, it's got me curious. I'm like, yeah. I'm I'm, I'm think, intrigued now. I think that time. I'm intrigued is, because yeah, because to, so can I just finish before you interject? Um, too many times I can watch the whole movie in the trailer. Yes, L you know, lately, these lately it's been so like the, that. yeah, the, the, lately you literally, you know, in the in the trailers before, you you would see an action scene maybe from the end in the being whatever, but in the beginning of the trailer, it, these trailers they literally do act one, act two, act three in the trailers. That's trailers true. before, action scene from the end would be at the beginning, action scene in the beginning would be at the end. Action scene in the middle would be at the beginning. Like it, it's it all made over no the sense. Place. Yeah. It's all over the place. The only thing they did was try to make you understand, like, I am going to to Buckmeister's house to give him his book. And then then you knew, okay, this is a journey about a book. That's the only thing you knew. You would right. see me uh trying to jump over Buckmeister's house in the beginning of the movie. You would see me getting chased by dogs. Ruko, did you open a library in the Fire Nation? Because you've been on books today. It's been on books <laughs> lately, yeah. <laughs> no, it's it's because um you and Rob have put books in my head because Rob's got books and you got uh, the web yeah. tunes thing. So just books is uh, books are in my oh, head. Okay. Now. Anyway, yeah. yeah, sorry, finish your point. Yeah, so because the trailer didn't tell you the it, it, it just t told you like there's gonna be a cool action scene. Um right. Zuko Wait, is which in it. trailer did you guys watch? I've actually. only seen the one with the with this one. The, the, there's only the one. one, there's only one where he oh, only one. He, he he's he's about to fall and then yeah, I've seen, someone I've says seen, freeze. I saw two I saw two trailers. So one I, I saw it was just one. a bunch of random scenes. I don't know what it was connected to. Was and then fake. this was the first one. It must have been fake. Yeah, I think this one, yeah. the one um this that, is the that, legit that, um, one. Yes. Mr. Extraordinary God, that's the one. Okay. I, that's the one I saw. So the reason so, this one, the Annie, reason are you okay? this one, <laughs> smooth, smooth criminal, Baba. Who has any guys? Kanina, kanina di menas. So the reason, because of all that, like every time you literally, and now the trailers these days, you see, here comes Zuko, and here this happens. And oh no, will Zuko overcome it? And then you basically see the whole movie in the trailer. Like there's mm -hmm. no suspense. So this one, it, it like I was waiting for like, okay, what's this about? What's going on? What's going? On? Okay, what? Wait, what? What? What happened? What happened? It got me curious. Right. I don't know if it'll be good. I don't know if it's the thing, but it got me curious. And that's the first. That's the that's the point of a trailer. A trailer is supposed to get you curious. You're not supposed to watch the whole damn movie in the trailer. So this one I am looking forward to because it's got me curious. And hopefully the next trailer that drops keeps in keeps it in that suspense mode so that I don't know what I'm going to watch. So that my mind is open to exploring. My mind or doesn't already like oh I'm gonna watch this 
And then when something, when it doesn't happen like that, then I'm mad because I thought I was coming for this movie. But that, because I don't know what I'm going to be watching, my mind is like this. And now I'm more receptive to the little clues and I'm actually paying attention to the movie because I'm taking out the clues. All right. That's fair. Rob? Um, okay. Um, I had no hope in this movie. I just want to start off by saying that. And they were like, oh, it's his magnum opus. He had to sell mm-hmm. his whole vineyard to make this whole movie. Yeah. It's like, oh. Because well. apparently he does wines. I didn't yes, know that. He did wine. Yeah. I mean, it makes sense. No actor just has actor money. They all have shares in everything, dog. Right. So uh, it makes sense to me. So, but then when he's like, okay, because my first and only thought was, as soon as, an, as a director says to me that, I'm about to watch the most over, the most bloated, yeah. self-indulgent, Zack Snyder nonsense I've ever seen in my life. Wait, but did you feel like, <laughs> did you feel like that when you watched uh, um, um, Martin Scorsese's Silence? Yeah, I, I wasn't a fan of Silence, dog. I, don't get me wrong, it's not a bad movie. I'm not at all. I'm just like... It's I not one of his but, best. Yeah, yeah, I get what you mean. I didn't need to watch this. It's not right. New York. It's not right. Departed. It's right. not any of those. It's it's far from Departed. Yeah. Yeah. And remember, yeah. he says distribution agencies said no. So already my thought was, I bet you this, this movie doesn't have a plot. Yeah, like Francis Ford Coppola, apparently <laughs> most of the studios actually yeah. rejected the story. They're like, no, we're not going to do this. Yeah. And that's what, Zach, that's, what they, that's what Zack Snyder said. That's what they said to Zack Snyder as well. No. Oh, it Lord. turns out it was no for a reason. <laughs> you know I mean? Can more people say no to Zack Snyder, please? Can more people say no to him? Like... Yo, Jess, no, I'm but tired. then every time, uh, but every then time Zuko, a movie drops, and then he's like, "No, but I need extended cut. Just make the movie fucking." Dude, Netflix said, fucking Net- "Netflix said, dog, Fuck you have man. all the range. With, like, you have cut blanche. Yeah. Netflix gave him cut blanche, and he still wants an extended cut. Why, dog? George Lucas, <laughs> why? <laughs> that means you don't know what you're doing. Udra marreta ka ho e la kuchu dira inge." Except black Lucas well. Yeah, Zuko sounds like a disappointed black mom. Hey, dog. <laughs> no, man, I'm just, it doesn't even produce the I'm movie, just so. tired. Buckmeister, you can't tell me that you have an a, a idea for uh, T'Challa versus Kang, and then I give you, and then you say you need 100 Rand to make it, and then I give you 120, and then you say, no, I need 50 more. <laughs> like, Come on. Yeah. I gave you everything that you wanted and then you still need more. That yeah. means you don't know, you don't you don't have a vision. You don't have you don't understand your vision. You don't understand your idea. I mean sometimes it does happen that uh, directors are over budget, but at least they still know what they want to do. Yes. But with yeah. Snyder it's no, like Zach, no no no. Zach he cannot he must not give be given free reign. Yeah. That's the thing. He needs a box. He yeah. needs a here and a here. Like but, this but is that- yeah, sorry, Rob. I think we, I think we, we really interjected with what you were saying. No, sorry, man. No, no, it's fine. My point is, it gets over bloated. Suddenly, there's no plot, right? Um, and not to, you know, pat ourselves on the back, me and me and Gutso. We basically talked about this in the last two movies, where there's film writing formats, where there's steps you take in between your plot, journey, right. journey stuff. So when someone says stuff like this, my first thought is. None of that's going to be there. It's going to end up being bloated. It's going to end up being slow. But having said all of that, that one minute trailer of him like freaking out because Adam Driver is a good actor. Yes. What? Yo, oh, he's just so good. Look, and he can he, be in he can be in bad things, but he's not the reason they are bad. Exactly. He's like JT. Mm. It's always mm. the best thing of a. He's always the best part of a bad thing. Same right. thing. Same thing with um Gary Oldman. Yes. Always yes. the best part of a bad thing. But right. anyway, yeah. My point ends up being that that time stop thing where I was like, oh, I'm watching a different movie to the one I thought I was watching. It was better than the Aculite trailer. It had no movie. Wow, you're right. The Aculite trailer. <laughs> it's way better because it changed. I'm like, I'm watching one movie. I'm watching another movie. Holy cow. And I still don't know what the movie is. Right. 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 So, yeah. I'm excited. I'm gonna. I'm. 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 I'm it's got my ten antennas going. So yeah, that's all I had to say. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. But now, um, uh, uh, well, uh my, now you've my... got me. You've got me scared now because <laughs> of what you said. As soon as someone says this is my magnum opus, I've poured everything into it. You are right. That's when they just do 
whatever it, it I becomes mean, look, free for, for me i was very it becomes like, for free me, I was just... and they do a q z w they do whatever the hell they want and it, and it only makes sense usually to doesn't them. make sense yeah. it only makes sense to them yeah look i mean francis ford coppola was an accomplished director so uh you know i'm pretty sure and i'm pretty sure people are gonna go off the name of off the strength of the name alone personally i was just confused the entire time i was just yeah. like okay why like I mean, yeah, I'm asking questions, but I'm like, I don't understand, like, what's going on here. So, I mean, after he does the smooth criminal lean, and then it looks like he's about to walk on air, and then the trailer ends, I, I kind of, I mean, for me, I was just like, I, 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 I wouldn't know what I'm going for. Like, me personally, I'm like, and I, I know I'm an action junkie at heart. I get that. Right. But I'm just saying, me personally, I'm like... Would I want to go spend money on something where I have no indication of what's happening here at all? Like, even if we go to, um, like, you know, Tenet again, back to Tenet with, um, uh, what's this? Nolan. That, yeah, with Nolan. At least there, I know people have backwards powers. I don't know why. I don't know what for. I don't know who's fighting who. But they can reverse time somehow. Right. Like, that was the pull, right? Right. right. Here, I'm just like, okay, is he stopping time? Did someone else shout? Mm. Because it seems like... Is it like, like the snapped... danger room? Because it sounded like he was talking to somebody. Yeah, and it, like he snapped his mm. fingers and then time started moving again. So I'm like, did he yell at himself in his brain? But then why did they do that echo thing? Right. So I'm like, I don't know what's... I'm not sure what the pull is here, personally, for me. I'm not sure what the... the But that's the pull to to me. Did that not catch you? Not not really, because I just felt like I was watching the Men in Black thing again, and I was just like, oh, okay, they're doing... uh, Is this Men in Black 3 uh, Godfather style? Because it's Francis Ford Coppola? I don't know. Right. Right. <laughs> right. Right. Look at what they did to my boy. I have to use the denuralizer. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, guys, do let us know your thoughts on um I don't want to butcher it again, guys. Someone help me there. Uh Megalopolis. Megalopolis. That's the one. Let us know your thoughts. <laughs> That's on one. It. 